good job today, Woody. How much my the toilet? The toilet. Nice. Got a leakage on the toilet. A leakage? Yeah. So I'm trying to find the right spare part by taking other ones apart. Okay. You've got lots of spare parts there, Woody. Yeah. <laughs> Replacing the uh, jogger valve, which is a fairly simple job to do, but it's it's rather unpleasant because you've got to flush fresh water into the pipe because there's always some backflow as you take the jogger valve off. So whatever's in the holding tank comes back out. So I flushed a load of fresh water through, um, take the pipe off. When I took the chocolate valve out, I found that there's a lot of calcium deposits in there. So I've scraped that out with a screwdriver as best I can and give it a clean out. See, that's calcium. Look. Yeah, that is. That's what they say, you have to bang it, don't you? Yeah. And uh, now I'll just put the new chocolate valve back in. Yep. What do you want me to do? So the new chocolate valve is back in, so we shouldn't have any any more backfill from the toilet, hopefully. Great. So no more unpleasant smells. So I'm just doing the finishing touches here. You've got to make sure you get the right part because there's so many different models of Jab School oh, toilets. Yeah. If you don't get the right part, it doesn't work. So luckily they, they kind of do this kind of simple diagram on the front so you don't get the wrong part. And you can identify them all with the label. Mm. So the different models have got different labels. Oh, nice. Yeah. Easy. Yep, and it's quite an expensive uh, service pack if you get it wrong. So. Okay, I think we're good to go. <laughs> so uh, what we do is we, uh, we have a salad dressing. Is we've got a good olive oil, we've got a nice white wine vinegar, and a squeeze of lemon. So, so you can use this actually in your salad as well. So we're going to squeeze, squirt it down there, just a couple of sprays. And then the olive oil will lubricate it, the vinegar will keep the calcium at bay, and the lemon just kind of just takes the, the smell away from the, uh, the vinegar, otherwise it smells like a fish and chip shop in here. 